Hello, Paul Hamilton here. We're going to look at how we can use uh, Procreate um, with uh, Aero, Adobe Aero. What I've got here is just some of my uh, daughter's beautiful artwork from Procreate. And what I've just basically done is just layered a couple of little um, different lights, uh, different kind of effects over the top. Um, and what I've basically done is we're, we're going to export this as a PSD uh, file uh, with all the layers intact. So what we want to do is create some depth. So you can see here I've got uh, the picture kind of in the middle or uh, second from the bottom layer. Uh, and if we actually layer all these down and we've got the girl at the front, then we're not going to get that layer and that depth effect. Uh, so if we actually turn off the background, we've got a nice transparent background that's going to look great in AR. And what we're just basically doing is doing some sketches and some different effects just to create a little bit of depth to our picture. Uh, so you can see here, you've just got some simple effects as we go through. What we're gonna do is export uh, PSD, and we're going to export that um, to our files on our iPad. So we'll call it something like a tutorial. Uh, we'll call it, uh, what do we call it? Tutorial um, Aero maybe, as we're kind of dealing with Adobe Aero here. So we'll just call it tutorial aero and we're just saving it to our files on our iPad. So that's basically it and now we're going to jump into aero. Uh, I found my plane on the ground and I've pressed press plus and I'm going to go to my files and I'll look for that file. Uh, there it is there. It might take a little while to come in um, depending on kind of what device you're actually using there uh, but there it is there and all I'm going to do is pinch to make that bigger and you can't really tell at this stage, but uh, the layers, what I'm going to do is touch on the actual object and down the bottom, I'm going to touch layers. And that allows me to, uh, let's go with Z at the start. Um, we can actually kind of distance uh, the different aspects of uh, the layers. So you can see here, if I kind of come in, I've got some depth there, uh, which looks really different um, from different angles uh, whether you look at it from the front or back. And so you can kind of play with your Y offset or your X offset, um, play around with some different effects there, uh, bring them closer together, further apart, a uh, whole range of different things uh, that you can actually do there. Um, so this is just a great way of kind of creating depth with two dimensional uh, elements uh, by using the Photoshop, or, or in this case, uh, Procreate layers. You can do the same with Pro, um, Photoshop. Uh, playing with layers and kind of creating that depth element to it uh, there. Paul Hamilton, hope you found that useful. Signing off.